If you like Venusaur now, wait until he gets his Mega, because that one's just really, really, really dumb. <laughs> in a good way. He, he's dumb in the same way that Mega Agron is dumb. <laughs> <Hey>. <laughs> because you can't fucking kill him. Because you remember, you remember Agron's fucking ability when he's Mega Evolved. It's just super uh -huh. effective moves just get noped yeah. into, into slightly less super effective moves. Uh, Mega Venusaur gets thick fat, which is basically oh, fire and you. fire and ice moves deal half damage. So that basically means he really does make super effective attacks just get fucking noped. They they turn into essentially normal type moves. So oh. you can't freeze him, you can't burn him. He's poison type, so you can't poison him. The only way that you can fucking take him down is That's either flying. going going for flying or going focusing on his poison type and going psychic because oh, you can't use ground either because he's also grass type i didn't realize that it got thick fat I oh god fucking mega damn it oh yeah no mega venus like venusaur was already good and competitive out of all of yeah. the fucking don't all of, hit yourself out of all don't the hit yourself starters, he was easily go. the best one but oh. so that's why i'm team balba baby and then when he got his mega he became even better he, he became a fucking stall team champion. <laughs> oh, my Bulba baby. He's... Mm, mm. Yeah, no, that's don't, that, that's don't, why don't in good. Sun and Moon I was fucking... Also, the fucking... The, the GTS. What the fuck? Who, who the fuck says, Oh, yes, I want to trade my fucking Bulbasaur for a fucking Necrozma. Are you what? fucking high? <laughs> Somebody, somebody's fucking uh, actually I'll fucking do it right now because I have my 3DS right here I'll fucking look on the GTS and see some of the fucking dumbass fucking offers people make yeah I've seen some weird ass shit let's see GTS fucking open that shit up you'll be connected to the internet yeah no shit that's what I wanted I'll look at it I'll look at it and once it loads up I'll see some of these fucking really stupid offers that people make. All right, so um, I've already healed. Hey guys, pick a color: yellow, blue, or red. Uh, red. Red. The only two of your answers. So that's the answer I'm going. Why? What was the question? You were picking what color film I was going to use for this project. Oh. Okay. Which I've been making. All right. Bliss, you remember the you remember the um sphere thing that I showed you? Yes. That's what I'm starting to do. Yeah, okay. oh. All right, noted. How does that make you feel? How's what make you feel? Uh, I was asking to Bliss. I was asking Bliss. How it made her feel that she was starting the thing. All right. Talk well, she was talking about, about about commissioning me to make a bunch of them for her to sell as merchandise. So I'd imagine she feels pretty good. Oh boy, looking pretty good. Open you son of a bitch! Hey y'all, I should probably. Uh, sorry for that. You're angry, Ellie, but uh, <laughs> just to point out, Maddie's leaving tomorrow. To go back to the the world uh, being seven hours ahead of us. Mm. Yeah. And um, you have to stay. No, I think she needs her I, sleep. I'd like for her to be able to talk more because I feel like we've all, we've all kind of been you know kind of overshadowing her. Yep. Not I'm intentional, sorry. mind you, because we're all just having fun. But I'm sorry, she Maddie. Wants, she wants to hang out with us before she leaves. Yeah. Woohoo! Watchful, uh, I mean, Dratini grew to, uh, level 35. Red. Yeah, no, I am not gonna teach it, Slam. Body Slam is good enough for me. Slam misses a lot. Alright, I found- Alright, the GTS is loaded. So, for Bulbasaur, one person wants Braxian. Okay, fair enough. Starter for a starter. Immediately, the next one over, they want Cosmog. 
Let's see. What else? Deerling, Ponyta. Okay, yeah, sure. Yveltal for a level one Bulbasaur. Oh, get Rayquaza for a level one Bulbasaur. Oh, Ambipom, whatever. Dialga for a level 10 Bulbasaur. Get the fuck out. Dialga, Groudon, Zekrom, Land. You want a Landorus for a level one Bulbasaur? Uh, Are you a uh, Nani, the excuse you? Yeah, for those of you who don't know, Landorus is a ground and flying type Pokemon. Also, the only ground and flying type that uh, fucking exists. I have exists. questions. Yeah, a ground so and I, I just a ground and ground flying, and flying. Type. That, Yeah, that makes it's a my, legendary. My head hurts. It, it is a legendary. Yeah, I mean we also have a fire and water type. So I can hear the gears in Brett's head turning as he tries to process that. This oh. film is disappointing me. It doesn't have a sticky side like it was supposed to. No. Shit, I might have ordered the wrong stuff. I'm gonna cry. <sighs> well, I can't concentrate anyway. My brain needs to. But, like, ever since that one conversation we had about. About competitive uh, Pokemon Solar, I every time I talk Pokemon with you in the vicinity, I keep on thinking of Durant. I I fucking hate Durant. Durant has been completely ruined for me because of how people use it in fucking Pokemon Showdown. Durant is cancer. I mean, it's also partially due to the fact that Pokemon Showdown, as good as it is, it hasn't quite nailed down how like abilities work. Because oh. in the actual games, you can't actually use entrainment to transfer fucking truant. Because truant isn't an ability that can be transferred. So, that's that's also partially on the game itself for being able oh. to do that. But because of that, Durant has been completely fucking ruined for me because fucking I can't God. fucking stand people that Damn, use that's that annoying. shit. Use them like that. It's fucking God, annoying. Magic Pixel has become such an, a constant thing. Oh, you want to talk about magic pistol, magic pixels, magic, magic pistols. Pistol. Wait, wait, <laughs> wait, wait until you fight a Blissey. Those are oh, Gen God. One Blissey. Oh Gen, no, Gen Two Blissey. Gen Five Blissey was also notoriously hard to kill. Blissey. You know what else? You know what else is hard to kill and really fucking annoying? What? Snorlax with immunity. Oh. <laughs> like, okay, Blissey is one of the most annoying Pokemon to try to hurt. Not you, Lightning Bliss, the po the big pink Pokemon. Um, because it 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 has the most obscene amount of HP. HP stat. Not like, even defense game. stat. Its defense stat isn't even that good. But it has so that. much it's HP, garbage. it doesn't fucking matter. And then its special defense is also just... Why? Like, this is just an HP wall. You... you I don't... Mm. Something hate. something stall wall. All the way. Like, something something fuck you. And then, on top of that, soft boiled. <laughs> Let me just refill half my health in one move. It is rather obscene. Now well, let's see how good he can do here. Aww. And that's just hilarious. Ugh. Derek brought up Whitney and her mill tank. Ooh, yikes. I mean... Rollout's a pretty scary move. It is. If if it gets traction, oh, you're in for it. <laughs> but luckily, it's one of those moves that it takes a couple of turns to really go. So you have a small window to be like, stop! The, no, Rollout is like basically one of the only moves that can actually scare Snorlax. 
Because <laughs> I remember, it was really funny. I was playing Pokemon Showdown like a, a, a while ago. It was like a couple weeks ago. And I decided I wanted to play Gen 3. I wanted to do some Gen 3 matches. So I had, I had naturally, I had my Aggron. Because why not? Oh, fuck. I no, went up. No, no. I, oh, no, my okay. Team was I'm switching. I forget what it was. It was Titar was one of them, Agron was one of them, Sceptile was one of them, the other three I don't really remember. But fucking I had I had a Sandstorm because I had my Titar on the field. His last yeah. Pokemon was was a fucking curse set Snorlax. So oh, damn. So so he decided he was going to get his fucking his attack and defense all the way up, you know? So I said, alright, two can play this game, motherfucker. So I pulled out my Aggron in the middle of a sandstorm, a and he's immune to sandstorm because rock and steel type. That's yeah. hilarious. And I say, all right, you want to play this game? I'll play this game. And then I started using iron defense. Woo! <laughs> and, then, and then, on top of that, because megastones weren't a thing yet, I put leftovers on him. What the so hell? Yeah, so in this sandstorm, there are these two unkillable walls of just tightness muscle going oh, no. at it. All right. My, my Aggron is quad resisting this thing's body slams, so it's doing like four damage, which is immediately being healed back up. Meanwhile, <laughs> I'm whittling him down, but here's the thing he also has rest. Ah, no! So, so these two unstoppable walls are just <laughs> clobbering each other for about 20 fucking minutes. <laughs> Up until the turn that he was going to use rest, because I was using rock slide this entire time. I used rock slide and I flinched him. And I hate that's to how I killed him. Hey, um, I hate to cut the conversation for a bit, but I got to use the restroom, so I'll be back. Okay.